The Swedish police arrested two people after giving a violent rebellion in a protest containing the burning of the Quran and detained about 10 people. Organized by Iraqi refugee Salwan Momika, who initiated similar events that angered the Muslim world. Sunday's rally took place in Square in Malmo, a city hosting large immigrant population. The audience showed their feelings after burning organizer writings. Dedi police said that afternoon was atmospheric stormy, as violent uprisings erupted in afternoon. According to police, the meeting ended after organizer went, but a group of people were left behind. Approximately 10 people were arrested for disturbing the public order and the other two were arrested on suspicion of participating in violent uprisings. According to the media reports, the audience threw stones at Salwan Momika. At end of July, Salwan Naja, a 37-year-old and another man, chewed a copy of Quran in Stockholm, as they did at previous rallies as they caused diplomatic tensions between Sweden and middle countries. While Swedish government previously stressed that Swedish constitution maintained right to assembly and freedom of expression, condemned saints of Quran. In July, Iraqi protesters attacked Swedish embassy Baghdad twice July and launched a fire the diplomatic mission second attack. In mid-August, Swedish Security Service announced that it increased terrorist warning level to 4 on a 5 scale. And strong reactions awakened country abroad by making country a priority target Inda in sacred lands of Quran. At the beginning of August, Sweden decided to strengthen border controls. The neighboring Denmark, Quran, where sanctity people took place explained that he is thinking of prohibiting burning Muslim holy book. Sweden is thinking about the legal ways to follow the case. 